fatal incident took place at Workover Drilling Rig. The rig was released from operation in the evening and waiting for the daylight to start the rig move from the existing location to the new location. Few hours after the release during night, two forklift operators subcontractor decided to recharge the tire pressure of the forklift using the rig air compressor without informing any of the rig management team maintenance. Senior Tool Pusher, Truck Pusher While they were charging the tire, the metal ring of the rim flew away hitting one of the operators in his head causing him to pass away immediately while the other one was slightly injured. Inflated, deflated tire recommendations Inflated tires contain a large amount of stored energy. For example, the sidewall of a typical commercial vehicle tire has over 34 tons of force acting on it. Tires are designed to withstand this but if they are damaged or used while flat or significantly underinflated they may fail. The force can then be released explosively at an angle of up to 45 degrees from the rupture, which is often, but not always, the face of the sidewall, resulting in a destructive air blast and the ejection of high-speed particles if the wheel is not restrained, it can fly meters through the air. Similarly, failure of multi-piece split rim wheels can result in an explosive ejection of component parts. These types of tire explosions have led to numerous fatalities. Recommended Actions Do not inflate any tire that has been significantly underinflated until it has been adequately checked. Do not exceed the manufacturer recommended tire pressure for the size and rating of the tire. Use airline hoses long enough to allow the operator to stay outside the likely explosion trajectory during inflation. Lessons learnt Line of fire shall be always respected. When reinflating, take particular care to stay outside the line of fire explosion trajectory. Reinforce communication to workforce not to act without proper authorization contractor. Subcontractors shall be continually under proper supervision from the authorized personnel.